Hello, guys. I am back with another video. Today, we've got a box. Huh. So, let's have a look in this. This is going to be a definitely a multi part series. Definitely not going to try and jam this all into one video, but I'll let everybody have a look at it. Should be a fun little project. got here it's furry uh what do we got here have a nice day and thanks a lot fuzzy turtles well thank you fuzzy turtles all righty what do we have here everyone that's right It's the original Teddy Rockspin, 1985. The, the talking bear. Let's get rid of this block. Okay, yeah. So, uh, I can't even really remember what's wrong with this thing. Uh, I know the tape is a little bit uh, funky. Uh, so it's not playing. Apparently there is the original tape, but let's have a look and see what we're getting into here. Yep. There it is. And the tape player itself actually looks like it's in quite good condition. Probably just needs a little bit of a clean in there, but holy moly, this thing's dare say is pretty darn clean so yeah this is going to be uh for anybody that doesn't know uh teddy rock's been okay there's a company out there that was founded by ex-ceo of atari i believe it was his and his, and his right hand man so him and his right hand man went out to create a new company called wonders of the world and the wonders of the world are actually pretty it's actually a pretty big deal and most people don't even know about it they had three like breakout products that kind of propelled them into you know probably uh crazy riches kind of thing the three products were teddy rocksman Okay, this thing was like, this was the toy to have back when you're 1985. Like, this this thing was like crazy, huge hype on it. Like, everybody had to have one. And the fact of the matter was is that everyone couldn't afford one. Uh, they were actually quite expensive back in the day. So, I can't remember exactly what they were, but... Um, yeah, so basically it, it's it's like a singing bear, right? It talks. So there's the Hetty Rockspin, okay? And it, it did extremely well uh, back in the day. The other one was Laser Tag. Uh, Laser Tag was actually the original game, or the original vest and everything, was actually made by, well, they actually released it to the general public as a a toy to, to, toy to kids. So that was number two was the laser tag. So all, already on a huge roll with Teddy Rockspin and uh, they, uh, the, the laser tag, they are the ones that are responsible for actually bringing the N Nintendo or the NES to North America. So, uh, you know, they are the reason why we have those gaming systems in this country is because WoW brought Nintendo to North America. So those are the three items. So my intention is is to get one of each. 
I want a Teddy Rockspin working fully. I want a laser tag setup. And I want, obviously, uh, an original Nintendo, which I don't have right now. So, yeah. So, this is going to be first of many. Uh, I'm going to go through Teddy Rockspin. I think I have to fix his eyes, uh, which means I'm going to have to separate the entire uh, head assembly uh, to get to the mechanics in the back. There's little servos back there. Um, but I think his mouth does work. So, I think it's just his eyes don't work. Um and the tape player was a little funky. Those are the things that I know uh, about it. So join me for future videos <laughs> on rebuilding Teddy Rockspin. Peace.